over. We are down to the last game of this terrific competition. Two extremely good teams will go head to head for the trophy itself. Moments away from the kickoff, and we're live. Hi there, everybody. Big day today. Silverware is at stake. It's the final of the Checker Trade Trophy. I'm Martin Tyler, and along with me is Alan Smith. Will you please make some noise as we Rotherham United in our main match against Scunthorpe United. Rotherham United in excellent form. They certainly showed it in their home match, their last match against Bradford City. Well, they did play well. They, they took one of the few chances to win 1-0, but they aren't creating too many. And I'll probably lose here. Number six, Richard Moore. This is the 11 fielded by Rotherham for this game. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4-5-1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. This is the lineup. So, Alan, 4-4-2? Yeah, I think it looks that way, Martin. Yes, it's the conventional shape. It's the one that the manager prefers. Well, this is the Wembley Stadium of today. It's been open since 2007. It's got its own memories, and many of the supporters here will not perhaps think about the the former stadium where you graced of course Alan and many famous occasions were were staged but this is where it's all about now where it's at and it deserves to be here it's a magnificent structure it certainly is I mean I think it's still regarded worldwide as the home of football and as a football you just want to do yourself justice out there and our referee today is Brett Huxtable A prize and a lot of prestige at stake here. The final of the Football League trophy. Well, just walking up to the ground, you get a buzz. I mean, masses of fans outside, and they've all convened in here to hopefully see a, a great occasion. Hopper. Now Morris. It's looking good, this move. Hopper. Well, he's cleared the danger. Townsend. Bishop. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. David Ball. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Ball. That would be a throw. Neil Bishop. Bit of space for him. Now out on the wing. Snuffed out considerable danger with that interception. Neil Bishop. Bishop. Ford. Now this looks promising. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Holmes. Quick witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. Well, they're in a good position here.
Yates. Possession changes feet. Well, I like the look of this attack. Good cross into the near post. And it's gone out for a throw. Townsend. Bishop. Good interception. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Holmes. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Here's a chance! But he's had a go. Well, if you don't buy a ticket, as they say, and uh, fair play to him for having a crack. He's got some strength, hasn't he, to shield the ball like that. Two more minutes to be added on by the referee now. It's a combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Well, that is half-time, and the score is nil-nil here. Well, it's been a good first half in the final of the Football League trophy. Just sense going into the second half here, Alan. These teams know a lot about it. Well, the players, I think, needed a half-time breather. And they're refreshed, they're refocused. And the final of the Football League trophy, second half now underway. Yeah, this is when we're coming to the crunch. When the special players step up and really make the difference. He spotted a teammate and he's got the technique as well as the vision to switch the play. Could be dangerous. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Just cleared downfield, not a proper pass because the pressure is so intense. Ford. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. To put them in front. Out in front of goal. Throw in here. It's time for some fresh legs here. Well, he's thrown possession away. Now he's looking for support. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Ball. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Played away, well away from goal. Well, we could get some news on the injury. I think Jeff Shreves is on the case. Nasty landing on the shoulder for him there, and he's in real discomfort. He's a tough boy, I think he'll stay on. Well, Jeff, thank you for that update. Be thinking a bit of the cameras, one for the photo album with that save. Yeah, and I think his positioning made it easier than it might have been. Townsend. Bishop. Attacking well here. Hopper. Townsend. the teammates who are clearly on the same wavelength. Will 
the kick to the goalkeeper, goal kick. I think the coach will be considering his options on the bench. Substitution for Rotherham United. Coming off the pitch, number seven, Anthony Ford. To be replaced by number 22, Joe Newell. Now this looks promising. Proper tackle that. Gonna tie his luck. Now Newell. It's confident and it's classy really, but it is a bit of a gamble for the player who's still in possession. The pass not completed really. He's got support here. Well, that's good defending. Yates. And they cut it out. It goes out wide again. And we're now down to the last five minutes. And it's still nil-nil. over the bar and the manager deciding to go for it and bring on a new player and it's taken it is a corner that's too close to the goalkeeper he'll catch them all day Wallace Morris. Time for goal! Oh, nowhere near. No, he's miscued that one. Miscued it badly. That's a bold move. Extra attacker on. And it's good to see as they try to go on and win this game. Well, I think we all like to see that so often these days. It's just a lone striker, but uh, with two up top, you give yourself an extra chance. Final whistle of regulation time, and we go to extra time. Well, the coaches here have had their say. Both teams back in position now. We're looking rather tired as we finish regulation time. Guiding it through the defenders. This might be it! Worth the wait, I think, Alan, for this opening goal in the cup final. But this lad hasn't had many chances, but he was ruthless then. And that's flown past the keeper before, really, he could react. Another peek at that goal. Substitution for well, winning brings confidence. Whether it's overconfidence in this situation, we're about to find out. He's going to bring on an extra striker. Yeah, well, when he plays off, you're a hero, but when he backfires, you're a villain. Let's see uh, which part the manager gets at the end of this. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. The return ball. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. He's given offside. Yeah, he's playing on the shoulder, but just needs to hold his run a touch. Defence squeezed. They knew they caught their man off. Good refereeing there, because it was a foul, but they're playing on and playing on well. His teammates will thank him for that. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Well, nowhere near. Uh, he was a long way out. Yeah, I think that's a waste to try his luck from there. Town 
comes in. Into the attacking third. Players place another two minutes added on by the referee. I don't know whether the players really appreciate what's going on here with this support. They're loving the situation, aren't they? Players still trying to make sure they don't have any late slips. Yeah, it's a party atmosphere up in the stands. They've got to make sure the players that it doesn't transfer down to the pitch because they've still got a job to do. Been a So here we go with the second period of extra time. Good football between these two. Nice passing. Yates. It was good progress with this attack. He's caught offside. And you see what he's trying to do. It's all about the timing of the run. Doesn't need to go as soon as he did there. Have scored here now. Number 23, Rory McConnell. Newell. Some potential in this move. Good vision. Real chance. Can he deal with it here? My old says the referee. He's coming forward with some danger. And the build up, and it's a shot now. The match is still on the line, and a corner could be the game changer. Having played the advantage, he's now going back to deal with the infringement that he could have blown for. And the offender's going to get a yellow card. Yeah, I wonder whether he thought he got away with that because the play was allowed to go on, but no, he sees yellow. Well, amazingly, the defender saw oh, the goal and went for it. Two minutes of added time. And there's the cutback. Oh, well done, the goalkeeper. And he's hung on to the ball. Well, it's fantastic for the fans. It's pretty nerve-wracking for the penalty takers. Not too bad for the goalkeepers. Here comes the shootout. So the shootout starts, and here's the first penalty taker. his side of one but the penalty taker can keep his side in it by scoring oh, 
No nerves from him in this shootout. It's potentially a match-winning penalty. The goal and the game is theirs. And he's put it away to get the winning penalty. Well, it can look easy, can't it? And he's made it look easy there. That's it. They've won the Checker Trade Trophy. So, up they step for the souvenirs. Small trinkets, really, but they mean so much. Well, there's only so many trophies on offer during the course of the season. And that's why it does mean so much for any footballer to be in this position, to, to be on that podium. Wonderful stuff. It's such a fantastic feeling to win any football match, but to win one when there's major silverware at stake uh, almost defies description. I think they'd be delighted as well, Martin. In fact, they played well over the course of the final, that 90 minutes when they really did have to show what they've got. They responded to the challenge, and that makes it all the more satisfying. Well, it's quite a scene here. And suddenly, having looked tired towards the end of the game, they found remarkable energy. Yeah, they'll keep going all night now, I'm sure of that. The adrenaline will be pumping. Great team, great result. They're going over to their supporters now. And they're still together in the celebrations as they have been through the season. Yeah, you do get the feeling with these boys, they are a proper unit. There's really good team spirit within that dressing room, which you need at any successful club. These have certainly been that. Well, you have to have the team photo and they're getting ready for it now yeah one of those lovely scenes that you'll hang on the wall back at home 